Rajendranath Garu to address the gathering. Welcome, sir. Honorable Chief Minister of Andhra Pradesh, Shri Vyas Jagannath Reddy Garu, Honorable Ministers, Parliament Members, Legislators, my colleague Minister, Shri Guduvad Amarnath Garu, Excellencies representing over 20 countries, industry leaders from leading business houses in the country, business delegations, industries assembled today from India and Andhra Pradesh, friends from the media, ladies and gentlemen, Andhra Guda Nahudaipur Kanamaskar. It's our honor to have your attendance today. Historically, business, commerce, trade, industry, they all have been established in various areas for various reasons and advantages. It could be raw material, it could be market, it could be the workforce, it could be the ecosystem, or it could be stable government. We have seen in the past how European countries have colonized and then established industries. We've seen how people have gone and settled in the United States of America. We've seen the story of Japan, Korea, China, everywhere it's the same. Business goes towards where there is opportunity. Similarly in India, post-independence, a lot of industry has developed in certain states, in certain cities, all depending on the natural advantages that are available. Now, why AP? Why does anybody have to come to AP? There are reasons. As the tagline says, where abundance meets prosperity. Here we have some natural advantages in the form of agricultural produce. We are first in second, third in most of the agriculture produce, be it fish, shrimp, be it horticulture crops, be it pulses, be it vegetables, be it milk, be it meat. We are first, second, third in most of the agricultural produce. We have a lovely ecosystem for establishment of automobile industry, pharmaceutical industry. We are also in the area of the niche shipbuilding. We have certain advantages in the form of logistics where ports and portlet connectivity is available in abundance. Inland waterways are being created. We have proximity to the cities of Chennai, Bangalore, Hyderabad. We have an excellent workforce with a beautiful demography. We have wonderful skill development centers and skilling activity taking place. And most of all, we have abundant and maybe the best in renewable energy. And we are very progressive. The amount of progressive nature that is there in Andhra Pradesh is actually visible in the form of government correspondence. Probably we are the only state where government correspondence is done in the English language. And most of all, we have a very stable government and a dynamic chief minister who understands business and industry. And here we have Vizag, where the summit is being held, a beautiful city. All of us appreciate the beauty of Vizag. We have the strength in the form of a cosmopolitan nature, which is available in very few cities in the country. Similar to Delhi, similar to Mumbai, similar to Bangalore and Hyderabad, we have Vizag, where the entire population consists of settlers from all over the country at some point of time. A wonderful place to have our IT, IT-enabled services and financial services. Andhra Pradesh, we have actually moved over from EODB. We've been number one in the ease of doing business for about three years consecutively. Now we are concentrating on the cost of doing business. Post reorganization of the state, a lot of industry went to Hyderabad. Nevertheless, here we are Andhra Pradesh. We are young and we too have a dream. A dream the government and our chief minister has and resolved to restart all over again. A dream to re-establish AP on the industrial map of not only the country but the world. A dream to provide abundant business opportunity. A dream and to provide ample employment opportunity to our youth. A dream to be in the forefront of service not only to the state but to the nation and the world. And most of all, a dream to provide a government of the people, by the people and for the people. Welcome everybody, welcome all the delegates to Vizag, the jewel of the East. Welcome everybody once again to Vishakapatnam, land of destiny. Thank you. Dhanivadalu Shri Rajendranath Garu, those were words of wisdom.
we see our state rising and scaling new heights in the future. They say a picture is worth a thousand words. We now bring you a visual treat that journeys the success story of Advantage Andhra Pradesh. Let's enjoy the audio-visual presentation. <laughs> 